Alright, what's up guys, Inferno here, and welcome to the Quadruple Batmobile Bundle View on Rocket League. I've about lost my patience, man. I've recorded this twice. I recorded this once, and the microphone didn't work. I recorded it a second time, and I forgot to hit record. And, on top of it all, I have COVID. So, I am just not in the mood now. I, 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 yeah. <laughs> if you make content, you understand probably what I'm going through here. But, I'm gonna try to keep this as I've done the past two times now. And just go over all the customization on all of four of these cars. And then, tomorrow, I'm gonna have gameplay for the six. 16 and 1989. Friday, I'm going to have gameplay as well as hitbox testing, by the way, for the Dark Knight Tumblr and the 2022 Batman. So, for the next like three days or so, it's just going to be all Batman related things, as well as a Gotham City Rumble have out road weekend and Modern Warfare 2's open beta, which is also this weekend. So, we got a lot of stuff coming out. So, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of it. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like. Let me know in the comments what kind of Batman you plan on getting. And if you do get anything, make sure you use my supporter credit codes in front of zero. And yeah, let's just get on to this review. Real quick, let's go over what you can actually buy. You got all four individual cars at 800 credits a piece. In these packs comes with cars, with gold explosion, and the decals of real life decals. And it's the same for everything. All four of the bundles have the exact same type of decal, goal explosion, and car. Or you can skip buying 3,200 credits all four and get 2,000 credits all four. Save you 12 bucks and just buy the ultimate bundle. The individual packs would be fine if you only wanted one car, maybe two cars, because two cars you could still save 400 credits. But if you just want to get everything and definitely 100% get the ultimate bundle. If you didn't want the cars and you just wanted the items, like for example, you had these cars back before they added them to the item shop and they didn't have real life decals added to them. So you don't want to spend eight dollars on getting the pack just so you can get a decal then these options exist for you here if you don't want the cars you just want the gold exposure for example so you can put on the octane dominance etc which by the way these gold exposures do work on every car in the game then you can go ahead and buy these individually however i don't see the 2022 real life decal or a 2022 gold explosion so i feel like if you wanted 2022 you'd have to actually buy the batman bundle but that all being said let's get into the customization right, i'm gonna cheat here for the first car because the first car i only have on my xbox and i'm not about to boot up the xbox to do that whole five minute process again for the third time so instead we're just gonna take a look at my video i made back in october 2021 and just see what they got for the customization here this is what the car looks like in general here it looks good you have a real life decal on which takes away all of everything pink and just makes it full gray which hopefully i show off here yeah there you go the full gray right there i actually have every other car so i'll be doing customization this the normal way for the rest of them but i'm just I, I i'm not i'm i didn't touch on this in this video but for the paint finish you can change this to whatever color you would like to if you don't use decal if you use real life and real life is the same for all four cars if you use real life, you can't change the colors at all. The wheels, you cannot change at all, and you cannot put these wheels in any other car in the game. And they don't look that great, but they also don't look bad either. They just kind of exist, in my opinion. Oh, and this is me confirming that you can't actually... Uh, I was wondering what I was doing here. Yeah, this is me confirming that you cannot put the wheels on the other cars. That's what the boost looks like there. You kind of can't really see it well because at the time, this map was the Salty Shores. But this is what the boost looks like. It doesn't look bad. It looks pretty clean, actually. This is very scuffed, and I'll do... Uh, when I go back and buy it on my Xbox and put down the PC, because there's a whole thing of that I'll explain in tomorrow's video when I actually do gameplay for Batmobile. But when I get to that, I'll go over to customization one more time, because this is very scuffed. I apologize, but I'm, I'm not about to do that for the 8th house of time now. You can change the top or the antenna, and I actually can show off a goal explosion in-game. It's right here in the item shop, a 2016 gold explosion. And that looks pretty sick. Uh, it actually makes things look better, the fact that this map is just nighttime, and that's what you're seeing in the background. And I guess I can kind of show off a Batmobile by doing this. So this is what that real life decal looked like, by the way, a full gray. I didn't really get a good picture in the video. And I will have an engine sound for every other car, but because I don't have a Batmobile, obviously, I'll have an engine sound up for this tomorrow. I apologize for that again. I'm just, I'm, I'm at my wit's end when it comes to the technology being stubborn today. I'm sure you guys understand, right? But uh, anyway, let's move on to the next car now, the 89 Batmobile. 89 Batmobile looks pretty cool. It's a dominant hitbox, and that other car is a plank hitbox, by the way. The 2016 is a plank. No decal. It looks like this. You got the nice little contrast of the stripes, and you got the turbine that's painted as well, which I thought that was really cool. And in real life, just kind of takes away all that. So if you like this kind of style, then that's cool. But personally, I like having the contrast, especially since you can change the color to whatever you would like on blue or orange. Wheels you cannot use on any other car, but you are stuck to use them on this car. The wheels you cannot put on any other car, and they're stuck to this car. There's nothing too special about them, if I'm being totally honest. The boost looks pretty sick on the other hand. It's like a nitrous boost, but just extended and cleaner, in my opinion. Now a lot of these toppers, now a lot of these antennas, and this is what the gold explosion looks like when I can find it. There it is. Now that looks sick. I like the little sound effect that it plays. Trail, you're stuck with this, and but it does look pretty cool though. And this is what the engine sounds like.
I'm not gonna lie, that sounds pretty good. Next up on our list is the Dark Knight Tumblr. This bad boy right here. This is the only Octane hitbox Batman out of all four of them. So if you're an Octane main, this is probably the car you're gonna end up choosing. Definitely looks the most unique out of all four of them, 100%. This is no decal for the blue team and the orange team. This is camo on the orange team and a blue team, and real life is the same for both. Unlike other Batmobiles, you're not allowed to change a paint finish if you choose no decal. Same applies for camo and obviously real life, like all four other cars in the game. The wheels are stuck to this car and you cannot put them on other cars, and they kind of look all right, I guess. The boost is pretty much exactly the same as the 89 Batmobile, except it's got the little blue sparks coming out of the sides, which I think it looks pretty cool. No toppers, no antennas, and here is the goal explosion. Which that's gotta be the best goal explosion of a four in my opinion. This is the trail and it kind of reminds you of light speed but with that extra copper in the middle to give it some like what's the word we're looking for? Death? And here is the engine sound. And that's gotta be the best engine sound so far. And last but not least, you got the 1989 Batmobile. Which, by the way, if you don't want to wait till Friday to see me do the hitbox and the gameplay of this car, I made a video, I want to say like five, six months ago, back when 2022 Batman first came out, as its own separate bundle of view if you want to check that out. I think it's like the third most viewed video on my channel, fourth. As far as decals go, we get this little shine if you have no decal on, and real life just takes away the shine. So nothing too special. I do like the shine, however, and you can change the shine to whatever you want. Wheels, you can not put in any of the cars, and this is the only wheel you're allowed to put on this car and it doesn't really look anything special in my opinion i mean i like it it looks clean it's just nothing flashy you know boost itself doesn't look that bad i think it's like a magic missile flamethrower combination toppers you cannot use antennas you cannot use and here is what the gold explosion sounds like here it is a batman I think this one's pretty weak. The bell is cool, but it's kind of weak compared to the other four. This is what the trail looks like, and it kind of reminds me of other 1689 Batmobile. Which that's not a bad thing, because it's pretty good, so. And for the last time today, here is the engine sound. Yeah, that sounds pretty sick. This seems like the only car that actually sounds like a real car, if that makes any sense at all. At least like a real beefy car. If that makes any sense at all, it probably doesn't, but anyway. Yeah, there's all the customization for all four cars. Like I said, we're going to be doing a 16 to 89 gameplay and hitbox tomorrow, as well as a Dark Knight Tumblr and the 2022 Batman hitbox and gameplay on Friday. So make sure you stick around for those. As well as we're going to be covering the Season 8 Elite Pack, Season 8 Rookie Pack, the new Rumble that just got added to Gotham City Rumble, as well as Modern Warfare 2's open beta that comes out this weekend so if you don't want to miss any of that make sure you subscribe and be a part of the channel if you enjoyed this video at all make sure you drop a like and let me know in the comments which batman you plan on getting if any at all if you do pick up any of them make sure you use my code inferno of a zero and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video peace